Poor planning. It hasn't finished downloading and we're leaving now. <laughs> Merci et toi. Est-ce que je peux aller aux toilettes, s'il vous plaît? Mm. Voulez-vous coucher avec toi ce soir? Let's do an outfit of the day. Outfit of the day is my Nana Asla dress. These $20 shoes from H&M that Stephanie bought me that are very dirty. These socks from Amazon. And this face from those two people. <laughs> actually mentioned it but we're in Quebec if you couldn't tell from all the touristy things that I have filmed so far I don't know what time it is but it's like late in the evening and we're just kind of walking around we just had dinner and we're looking for dessert so I don't know what we're gonna get probably ice cream or something I'm kind of craving something sweet anyway and then I showed you the castle which is also like a hotel I don't know exactly what it's called so I think we're gonna go on a tour tomorrow and then maybe I can like figure out what it's called and properly pronounce it because everything is in French here. There is some history there too that I kind of want to explore more tomorrow. Let's go get some dessert. <laughs> we're taking a pause from getting dessert and we just found a Christmas store so we're gonna go inside and look at all the fun stuff even though it's like almost July. All our trouble will be miles away Gosh, it smells like Christmas tree. What's the verdict? It's good. It's just chocolate. <laughs> so you can't go wrong with that. Hello and welcome to the next day of our Quebec City trip. So we are just done getting ready now and about to go out to have breakfast. Not sure where we're eating breakfast yet, but I will show you when we get there. I am excited. Yeah, and that one follower is you. <laughs> You can say hi to yourself in a second. Um, I don't know. Oh, we're going on a tour, which I will possibly film if I can. It's like the big hotel in Quebec City that looks like a castle and has over like 600 rooms. Um, the one that <laughs> we couldn't go to, but that's okay. We want to go shopping. I want to buy some super cute clothes. And what else are we doing? Taking pictures. I'm on, I don't know. I'm on Quebec Tinder now. You are? Mm -hmm. Is there cute French guys? I don't know. They all look the same to me. No. Oh. Is there profile in French? Some guys. Yeah. Yeah, it's funny because like I have I know zero French and people keep talking to me in French and I'm like I do not understand you. So 
But for the most part, people speak English too. They just like their go-to is French. Je m'appelle Lafayette, the Lancelot of the Revolutionary Set. I like hearing all the French people and I like their accents. I like accents. It's cute. Yeah. Are you gonna show me? I can show you right now. Hi, Brats. What are you eating? I don't know. It's a pretty breakfast. Maple braided strudel. Strudel? Schnitzel with strudel. <laughs> I don't think that's. I don't think it's that's the it. lyrics today. Okay. I'm going to go soon because, like, my parents are coming to take over babysitting Snoopy so then we can go and eat. And look at this boy! Snoopy! Snoopy's not very happy because he wants to be with my mom and dad. But look, look at his view. You want to show everyone your view? Look. What are you staring at? A building. He's contemplating the meaning of life. He's telling us the weather. He's saying, oh, it stopped raining. Thank you for letting us know, Snoopy. mantle piece you saw it has never been uh, what can I say changed since 1892 since the original and you have the uh, coat of arms or the ship on which Champlain because the city founder Samuel de Champlain he came on a ship called the Don de Dieu the gift of God it's what you see just above Champlain now we'll take a look at the greenhouse the greenhouse was added up in 1993 so when the hotel turned 100 years old so it ended up Two, two greenhouses, one here and one in the other bistro style. Wow. Now my tricky question is, what does the word Quebec mean? We don't say Quebec, we say Quebec. The old spelling was with a K. It's got a relation with the river. So if you look across, you have a Ferris wheel on the other side. You have a town called Levi, L-E-V-I-S, with a river. Does it mean channel or narrow? Narrow, exactly. A narrow passage or where the river narrows. So it's often used for conventions or as well for wedding receptions, for a small group as well, for a small reception. So I'll look. So we we'll do a taste of uh, when it's all set up. Of course, today there was a wedding this past Saturday. And as well, the Rose Room was used during the Second World War. There was two conferences in Quebec City with uh, Churchill, Roosevelt, and Mackenzie King, who was the Prime Minister of Canada, who was the host of the conference. So ladies, uh, Churchill and Roosevelt, were in charge. All right, so we'll uh, take you inside the ballroom. Of course, right now, the ballroom is not, uh, the tables are still there. There was a prom night. So kids from high school in Quebec City, having their prom night at the Hotel Chateau Frontenac. So the tables are still set up, but of course not as beautifully set up as they were last Saturday night. So we are privileged to be able to go inside, so follow me. I'm so jealous of those students. <laughs> but wait till you come here. 
So they put money, parents put money in as well, so they can uh, live the life. Big bright. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but I was not invited. Like, uh, for so that's the ballroom. So we are in the St. Louis Wing, 1921. We've just finished our tour for the Chateau Frontenac. Yeah, I figured out how to say it because the tour guide was repeating it constantly. And uh, right now we're going to go shopping and just explore Quebec City some more. Maybe even look at old Quebec City, the underground street. And yeah, I really enjoyed the tour. I thought it, there was a lot of history obviously and I really liked seeing the rooms. The room that he showed us that we could stay at was the cheapest and it was like $500 a night. So it was a little much, but I was like, the room was really nice, I thought. And there was also some really pretty rooms, like the pink room. Don't remember what it's called, but the view was beautiful. The rose room? The rose room, probably, yeah. The restaurant was nice. And I also we also saw the ballroom. I think I filmed all those things anyway, but I was really loving the ballroom. Obviously, just the idea of it was really cool. And yeah, I definitely, my goal one day is to stay in this hotel. The, the tour guy was saying like, you need to treat yourself and feel like royalty. You gotta feel like a queen and king. to go on a pretty long road trip back home yeah I'm gonna miss it here actually like it was a really beautiful city and I loved how the aesthetic of everything was very European it made me feel like I wasn't in Canada <laughs> thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video There was a man right behind me. 